For instance, ever since I came here, you had your eye on me. I'm so scared. When you entered my cell and you touched me all over with your search gloves on, there was nothing I could do. I was so scared. Poor little Lily. You little bitch. All right, what do you want? Well, that's a lot better. I want to escape, Miss Baxter, and you're going to help me do it. I can't do that. You know I can't. You, you might be worried now, but you'll do it. I know you won't let me down. Okay, how? Now let's see how stupid you really are. Come on. How? Helicopter. From the roof. Come on. Come on. Come on. Open your mouth. Swallow it. Just a little bit more. Come on, you druggy. Come on. Put... That's the last one. Put it in. You bloody bastard. Come off it, Stella. Come off it, you bitch. Oh, no, you don't. I don't know what was... I don't know what she drugged me with. It was something... You're gonna pay, you bitch. Four drug packets have just gone down the toilet. That I can promise. What the hell do you mean? Ah, oh, now that would be telling. Now you tell me, you little smart bitch. Ouch! <laughs> you tell me what's going on. Tell me what's going down, or I might forget oh. everything and oh. kill you. Beryl and Pearl got rid of the stash that you gave Adams and Cunningham. They put it down the dunny. Here thought it would be funny to give Sarah a little buzz, seeing she was coming off the drugs. <gasps> oh, why no. would she do that? Why would she do oh, that? I don't know what she bastard. Was... Isn't that right, you yeah. filthy bastard? It doesn't what? hurt, little bit of dope. All the girls do it, didn't they? Yes. But it does when it was a red dragon and a tranquilizer. Which... Oh. oh, what a bitch. Oh. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> well, you're gonna wish you never came up with that evil plan. You're scaring me shitless, Brown. I'll take you on. I can take anyone on. Come on, Adams. I'm all yours. I don't want to hear a beep out of you. Let's take things nice and easy, eh? Oh, no, please. Oh, actually, I can't I scream, can I?
corridors. Sorry, uh, Miss Radcliffe. It's just off to the um, toilet. You're supposed to ask an officer. I uh, know. I'm in a bit of a rush. I wonder where Mr. Taylor is today. He said he's going to come back to finish the air shaft. Did he now? Yeah, he's um, normally here by now. Well, if he's any later, I'll have to report it to the governor. Thank you for telling me, Askin. Now move. Well, what an eventful afternoon it's been. Yes, well, you could say that. I can't wait to get home to have a cheesecake sandwich. I prefer like a ham one. Oh, hello. How are you? Hi, I'm Ron... Ron Raymond. From uh, Tates and Doyle. Sam couldn't make it today, so I'm filling in for him. All right, well, I'll show you through. Well, I'll um, show you through. Oh, all right, you do it. Bitch. Sign in first, then we'll uh, take you through. <sighs> Look, okay, Tamworth, but if this goes wrong, I'll make sure all the blame goes on to you. Understand? Now, this is the corridor where the main air shaft is. Look, Tamworth, just stop wasting my time. Now, get back to work. I'll, I'll, I'll be fine from here. Oh, right, okay. Oh, wow, wow, you shaped up real well. Look, listen, does she know that other officer about this? Because I'm risking everything for you. Oh, don't be silly. She's only arranging my escape. Wouldn't want her to miss the big bang now, would I? And, and then we can get married on the outside like you promised. Yes, like I promised. I like the wig. Look, it's not funny. I'll place the bomb in the air shaft. It's the best place for it. How long have I got, Freddy? I'd say about 20 minutes. How long will it take for that pig officer to set it up for you? Yeah, she'll be ready for us. You better be right. Otherwise, you won't be going anywhere but sky high along with the rest of them. What about Sam Taylor? He won't be causing us any problems anymore. I tied him up in his own flat, gagged him. Why didn't you kill him? Look, everything's going to be fine. What about Maysworth? Let's just say. She's certainly going to be turned off of men for a while, that's for sure. <laughs> Come on, let's get going. And you're doing so well with Drake. I've never ever seen her so happy. Look, I, I see your point, Miss Peterson. Why did you have to go and get involved in, in a fight? You know types like Adams. Why did you fall for it? Look, I'll think again next time, won't I? You better do, Brown. I'm warning you. Now, do you know anything about Cunningham ending up unconscious? On the floor in your dormitory? No. What the hell has happened? Someone attacked her too. Come on, I know I've got a bad temper, but I am not some sort of mad loony that goes around thumping everyone who stands in my way. Plus, who'd want to hurt Carol? That's what we want to know. It's obvious you're up to no good. That's why. What are you saying exactly, Jane? You and that Tamworth girl. You were caught red-handed. Like I told Mrs. Peterson, it was a setup. She roughed herself up to make it look like I did it to her. And you bunch of bloody idiots obviously fell for it. Well, it goes to show what solidarity means between staff around here. <laughs> Lovely day, isn't it? What would you know? You're not even outside, silly. I know, but it's going to be a lovely day. I can feel it in my bones. Oh, hello, Beryl. Hello, love. Where have you been? You, um, you never told me what you're in for, Beryl. Oh, it's a long story, love. See, dear, I used to work in a kitchen at a huge mansion house. I was one of the cooks there. To cut a long story short, 
See, I, I was accused for poisoning some sheep shearers. Oh. But you, you didn't do it, did you, Beryl? No. No, I didn't. But, you see, the department soon found out that I'd been framed and... And, and I'd already done my life sentence. <gasps> That's awful. Yeah. Oh, but I got a lot of compo. Didn't I, girls? Yeah. Oh, it suits you, love. It really suits you. Oh, thank you, Beryl. <laughs> See, the only thing is, money's not always a good thing, love. Uh, when I got out of this place, I blew the whole lot, didn't I, on booze? I love you. Oh. Where, where did you go? I went to Sorry, all different Sue. places. Love. I, I really am. I, I, I do understand, Governor. I might go into porn. Yes. Yes. The porn industry. Yes. You know, you'd be good at that. I, I will miss this dump. Yes, it sort of grows on you, doesn't it? Well, um, I'll pop to the staff room and get my stuff. Oh, Tamsworth, what the fuck is going on? Oh, hello, Mrs. Radcliffe. I felt a little crook, so I thought I'd come in here and have a little lie down, you know, and I was going to make a drink. I was going to make a drink. I need one. Come on, do you want one? Wanna see Sister Kelly? You thick old maid. Oh, you don't look too well. Governor, what's wrong? I'm hungry. The visiting board's just left with all of Mrs. O'Regan's baked goods. Oh, hello. Isn't Sam coming today? No, I'm filling in for him today. He's uh, up on um, on holiday. Uh, no, he, he can't be. Well, he is. Oh, there must be some sort of mistake or something. Um, he was supposed to be in today. What's your name? Sandra, why? I don't need your crap. OK, women, there's a bomb in the prison. Now I want you to all follow me in an orderly fashion down to the reception area. Oh, bloody ripper! Leg it! Just go through, just go through, girls. Oh, who are you? I'm Kevin, and this is my partner. We're from the Bomb Squad. Oh, uh, Blackheart Bomb Squad? Yes, that's right. We've come all the way from Perth. We've come to disconnect the bomb for you. Yes, well, hopefully there's only one. Hurry up and go through. Go through to the yard. Grahams, go on, hurry up. Stay back. Keep back, women. Don't push me. Governor, what are you doing here? Don't look at me. Pretend you're not looking at me. But, Governor, you're supposed to be in your scene, on the roof. I know, but you need more prisoners. Oh, bloody hell! Come on, be quiet, the lot of you. Adams, I told you not to go walking off. Oh, shut your big gob, you gutless wonder. What's going down? 
There's a bomb in the prison. Bloody hell. There's a helicopter. Oh, I hope everything's gonna be okay, love. And where's Sandra? Mrs. Bailey, you're not supposed to be a prisoner. I know, I know, but there's not enough supporting actresses. A lot of them have come down with the flu. Hurry up, Tamworth, get in there. I owe you one, Mrs. Baxter. You owe me nothing. Now get in there. I'll be glad to see the back of you. Mrs. Baxter, what the bloody Mary is going on? It's an escape, Governor. It's an escape. God, she's firing at us quick. Bitch, she's shooting at us. She's shooting at us. Bitch, she's trying to kill us. I think we got a fire. Oh, God, no, Lily! <coughs> oh, quick! Help me, help me take this damn thing off of her! You grab that end, Stratton. Oh, God, she's rolled out like a roller lino. Oh, she's dead. <laughs> Lily. Oh, Lily, come on, I'm going to help you get out of there. Oh, Mrs. Radcliffe. Are you OK? Yes, I'm fine. But what's going on? I don't know what, really, what the fuck's going on, but I know we've got to get out of here. <laughs> I could hear for all the women on the garden. Everything's gonna be all right now. Everything's gonna be fine. Oh. Oh. Bloody hell. This room's caving in on us. Oh my god. Are we gonna be all right? How's it going up there, mate? Not too bloody good. He's ripped up so many of these bloody wires. I think there's someone out there. Hello, is there someone out there? Who is it? Who is it? Who is it out there? Are you okay? We, we heard the bang. Are you all right? Well, I, I know I wasn't dreaming of a helicopter when one came flying through the bloody room. We'll get you out of there if you bear with us for a little while longer. Oh! oh. Yeah, we're all right.
Oh, thank God for Sandra. Yes, we're all right. Governor, I've got a confession to make to you. Yes, go on. It's Cunningham, Mrs. Peterson. I left her in the infirmary. I left her. Me and Adams made a quick break for it. What happens if she dies? What if she's blown up? Well, who's to know that she was ever an inmate in H-Block, if I lie? What, you would do that for me? Help me, someone! Help me! There's a bomb in the prison. What? Well, what can we do? There's nowhere to hide. Well, let's just hope it doesn't blow. H how many bombs are there? Um, at the moment, we think probably one. Trouble is, we might be in for a shock. What do you mean? The person who put it here could have linked it up to any part in the building to blow any part up. <gasps> We're gonna die. to go outside help love yeah do you know where mrs raysworth is uh, uh, well i didn't see her check in the sarvo well do you think she might be stuck inside mr matthews do you know where melanie is well that's what i've been wondering oh no do you think she's stuck inside I don't think she came in the Sarvo. Oh, hang on for a minute. I don't think she came in the Sarvo. Are you all right up there? I've got a tiny wire here and it's just this big bugger now. Love. Good night, Sandra. Yeah, you too, Beryl. Good night, Mrs. Peterson. Good night, my girls.